Welcome back, YouTube. Now, where we left off, I just we just arrived at Ostagar, and I'm actually going to change my weapon. I'm a main archer for a while. Have my daggers for just in case. Now let's go over here and start exploring. Find all sorts of goodies just exploring. I think there's some over here. Oh, there's an effort. And there's a box. There's the box. Don't know what that's for. Just run around, run around, and find some more stuff. Some more down here. And we have found a gift. Now, gifts you can use to give to your companions throughout the um, throughout the game. They have gifts will bring their approval rating up, which is how much they like you. If they disapprove, that means they just don't like what you did. They approve, they like what you did. Uh, so we're just gonna take both these because we always need a health poultice. I'm not gonna bother talking to anyone because they all say the same thing. See? Make a watch over you. They all say that. I think the same actor, voice actor, plays them. to him, get some history of the place. This place hasn't seen such a bustle in centuries, I'll wager. Need a hand getting anywhere? Tell me about Astagar. Used to be a fortress a long time ago, so I understand. Back in the days when the Wilders used to invade the lowlands. You were just on the eastern side of the ruin. The Tower of Ishal is there, but Tern Loganes closed it off until the battle. This side is the King's Camp. We've got the Grey Wardens here, circle of magi, the chantry. You can't swing a dead cat without hitting somebody important. Do I hear dogs barking? This is Ferelton, isn't it? The king has his kennels on the west side of camp. Stinks from all the hounds. These aren't cute puppies, though. Some of those dogs bite the dark spawn and get too much of that blood in them. It's like poison. Slow, painful death. Terrible. Go on, I'm looking for a Grey Ward named Alistair. Try heading north. I think he was sent with a message to the Mages. That'd be only we. Good luck to you then. Now, of course, we can go through here and do some more exploring. Uh, this is the King's Tent. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hello. And then you have a low gain stand over here. You actually have the option of talking to low gain. You can miss the guard, but I don't feel like talking to low gain. And we're explaining dark spawn. Okay. into a box. Best the gossipers. I think there's some more stuff over this way. And of course a praying priest. Who says something different every time you go by her? I 
Let's go past there. Right, this is where the Great Wardens hang out. What's the problem? This is a Mabari, smart breed and strong. His owner died in the last battle, and the poor round swallowed darkspawn blood. I have medicine that might help, but I need him muscle first. Just why do you think I can muzzle him? Your grey warden soon will be. All wardens are immune to the darkspawn tank. The most you have to worry about is some tooth marks. Just how smart is this dog? Centuries ago, a mange bred them to be smart and understand what they're told. They can remember and carry out complex orders. Smart dog. Most valuable dogs in the world. Trouble is, they generally imprint to one master. Reimprinting them is very difficult. But without the medicine, the re-imprinting won't be an issue. Will you help? I'll give it a shot. Go in the pen and let him smell you. We'll know right away if he'll respond. Let's hope this works. I'd really hate to have to put him down. Now these are some awesome dogs. Now poor thing is kind of looks like a bit bull in a way, don't he? It's muzzling. Where in the wilds would I find this flower? It usually grows in dead wood that collects at the edge of ground pools. There'll be plenty this time of year. I'll see if I can find one. Good. In the meantime, I'll begin treating our poor friend. Which gives us a new quest. Yay! Now a little bit of trivia here. Um, every other origin can get this quest by talking to the kennel master here. The uh, human noble is the only one that already has a dog, so they can't get the quest by this way. They actually get the qu they can still get the quest, but it's later. Um, is there anything else here I need? Let's go talk to her. Look, it's a mage. Let's go talk to the mage. Greetings, young lady. You are Duncan's newest recruit, are you not? He's not a man easily impressed. You should be proud. Allow me to introduce myself. I am Wynn, one of the mages summoned by the king. I'm Mary. Well met, and good luck to you on the battlefield. To us all, in fact. Will you be fighting beside the king? Not precisely. The Grey Wardens will be on the front lines, not the mages. Still, we have our parts to play. To defeat the Darkspawn, we have to work together. It's not an idea everyone seems able to grasp. You've faced Darkspawn before? Stragglers, yes. Not the vast horde the scouts become. I wonder, how much do you know of the connection between Darkspawn and the Fade? We call it the Beyond, but I know of no connection. Any time your spirit leaves your earthly body, whether it's to dream or to die, it passes into the realm we call the Fade. It's home to many spirits, some benevolent, others far less so. At the heart of the Fade lies the Black City. What's the Black City? Some say the Black City was once the seat of the Maker. But when the mages from the Deventer Imperium found a way into the city, it was tainted with their sin. That tape transformed those men, turning them into twisted reflections of their own hearts. And the Maker cast them back to the Earth, where they became the first Darkspawn. At least, that's what the Chant of Light says. And the Chantry says many things. It may be allegory, meant to teach us that our own evil causes human suffering. Or it may be true. It is as good an explanation as any for now. 
this is something to ponder. Yes, occasionally it's wise to contemplate one's actions. But I'm certain Duncan has more for you to do than talk to me. And we will stop this episode here. I'm going to go sell some stuff over at the... Or in a minute. I have no idea what I'm doing now. But we'll stop right here. And we shall see you next time, YouTube.